Show of hands. Who likes scary stories, movies, things like that? Who is not afraid? I'm a chicken. I'll just admit it right now. But show of hands, who actually likes like scary stories? I like them. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, Bobby, I'll start with you. What what intrigued you about this particular story? You know, it actually wasn't the story itself. I I, I had no clue about the story. The, uh, the article, the story was sent to me. Uh, the New York Magazine story, and I, I thought it was like a really well-written story. But really, the conversation that I had with Ryan, which I had before I read the story, was what hooked me. And it was, you know, we were still in COVID. I think we had just gotten vaccines, and uh, but we were still in the grip of that and or coming out of that. And um, and Ryan said to me, you know, I don't know about you, but when this COVID thing happened, I felt so powerless. And I felt terrified for my family, like I couldn't protect them. And I couldn't protect them against something that I couldn't even see. And that really resonated with me. That really resonated because that's how I felt. I was terrified for my family. And I felt like this, this uh, empowerment that you naturally have in protecting your family was gone all of a sudden. And what do you do when that happens? And that's really what appealed to me. It was sort of the allegory, the allegory underneath the story of this family sort of finding the American dream and then having it be not what they expected it to be, you know. What an awesome description, because honestly, now that puts this on a whole different level for me. Naomi, uh, when you first read the script <laughs> and, and you met with Ryan Murphy, who I love his work, I've never met him, but I have loved everything this included that he's done. What 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 is it that drew you to this particular story? And what stuck out to you most about the fact that here's a couple, again, the American dream, but wow, strange stuff is going on. When I was told that Ryan Murphy was going to be calling, I was like, yes, that this is going to be a good moment. I'm um, I've, I've been waiting for that call. <laughs> um, I got on the phone with him. Oh, and, and I was also told about the um, the story. I went and read the piece and devoured it, found it incredibly juicy and jam packed with all the right things um, and really identified with the couple. I imagined that, you know, I would get really um, caught up in that need to stand your ground and fight as well as you know grappling with the fear and and um and and the tensions of it all